having tea. I thought I'd just come up here and make it, because why not? up uh, deep to find out if it was. It's not deadly. It's said safe for children, too. I don't know what it is. I have no idea. All I know is it keeps ticks off and keeps, uh, oh, here's some black tea. That's been sitting around. Put preservatives in it, so I bet it's all right. No, it is not. It's turned into kombucha. So I'm gonna have um, matcha tea. I'm all right, how you doing cartwheel video? How you been? What's going on? Eat some cherries. I don't have any cherries. The trees are, uh, all the cherries are off the tree now. I hadn't been to the barn. I was working on the, on the USS Turtle. I was working on that thing, and I was working on it uh, below. I haven't been up here. Um, so I'm like, well, I'll go up there. So I did. So I am. Still making this green tea. Now, I don't know. I don't know what the deal is with this green tea, this matcha. I don't know, is this regular green tea? I don't think it is. Maybe there's a little story on the back. Um, no, it doesn't, just tea, matcha, green tea. I don't know. Um, I, like the, I like the way it tastes though, it tastes real good. But if I had uh, half and half, I'd put half and half in it, but. I'm not going down to get it. You know, am I gonna do that? Oh man, sore. Been sore lately. What's everybody doing? Could start a painting, but probably won't. To get stuff a lot done today. We got um, started cutting Marty's hair. It's like a preliminary cut. I'm gonna take him in to have him finished out, shaved down. It's just like I can't deal with it anymore, Marty. We're cutting it. So at least now you can see. Um, what else? Didn't get the video shot that I wanted to, but it's all right, whatever. Um, what else? Um, porch got cleaned. Um, moved wood out of my car. I used the weed eater in the front. I uh, used the mower in the back. Um, I woke up late, so I didn't get my, as much done as I would like to. I woke up at, 
I don't know what time it was. Maybe 10.30. Pretty late. Uh, I worked with Tracer. Tracer was flawless. I did the dummy launcher with Tracer, and Tracer retrieved it without dropping it three times, which was fucking awesome. Um, what else? Did casting with Tracer, and I put the lawnmower in between the place targets. And, um, once again, flawless. Tracer was real good. So, I guess, um, uh, everybody's, or, um, I guess Tracer's respecting me, um, which is key. I mean, she had to quit doing that. She's jumping on me when she got back. Dogs, when they get excited, that's the, that's the point they screw up. They bark, lunge, bite, or just don't listen. That would come under lunging or, you know, just not listening. Jumps into, like, a um, sort of uh, dominant, excited mode. So, that's all good. Um, she had to stop doing it. You know, you gotta, you gotta get the dog to quit doing it. It wasn't always the easiest. It was not too difficult. Um, I also got Tracer to quit. Well, she's letting me put on an e-collar without, you know, touching, touching my, my hand with her mouth. That's just obnoxious that's like somebody going up and pushing you it's disrespectful so she quit doing that that's great when they start disrespecting they just like you know what's up jennifer they just sort of like you, you know if you don't weed your garden my garden out there there's a lot of, a lot of weeds in it you know it just goes to shit that's how my garden is right now so not enough time in the day. Um, that's it. I tease. Ow, shit, that was hot. I have some tea bags in the water, but I want this stronger. I'm gonna take a tea bag and put it in the cup. What's up, Wing Bone 69? I gotta, I gotta sweet, I gotta do something up here. This place is a freaking mess. Uh, green matcha tea. I don't know what the significance of this is. Like, how is it different than? Uh, yeah, thank you. Any thoughts on keeping a puppy off the furniture? Yeah, get your dog trained, because you're not going to be able to do it, because you're looking for some kind of free tip, like an idiot. You are. You're looking for an You're an idiot. You can't handle the dog. You're not going to be able to handle the dog. Why don't you go find a home for it? You're asking about the most ridiculous shit. And seriously, I'm being serious. You, you can't handle this dog. You can already tell. You should have allocated money to, to get it trained. But to people like you, you would think that training was like pet smart training. So I'm sorry. I'm just telling you the facts. You shouldn't have gotten a dog. You can't handle it. No, it's not. It's not called tell them to get down. Um, you know, it isn't. Don't, don't ever, don't ever on a dog, on my channel, give any suggestions about dog training. You, you, you're, you think that you're implying that it's that simple. 
It's not going to be that simple. It's probably not that simple for you either. You probably keep telling the dog to get down. Your dog's not trained. Either this guy's puppy is never going to get trained. Sorry to be the gloomy goss, but this is the fact. You know, you'd be, you know. That's right. No, down, down is down, off is off. That's right. That is correct. That is correct. Very good. This stuff is good. Okay, time for you to go, dick. So you're just an idiot. Um, I have uh, green matcha tea. It's pretty good, I like it. Is that true, James? That's true. Uh, his dog would bark incessantly. The whole family would yell, Duke, shut up, shut up. Everybody, and, and the dog never shut up, right? Because they, it just was a constant thing. If, if you can't bring it to a high enough pressure, they'll just keep doing it with anything. But with that said, you get a dog to stop doing something and then they'll start doing it again or something else. You know, it's, it's sort of how it is. What the hell is that? Just doing all over and you know, never shut up. Um, you know what works good for a dog shutting up is a super soaker. Um, or you can get them color conditioned and put a bark collar on them, not a spray bottle. It's not a cat. Oh, that's good. I guess a spray bottle could work on some, but you wanna, you wanna nip it in the bud. There's a dog here, a cattle dog that was barking every morning. Not this one, different one. Super soaker got her to quit. Oh my God, I needed that tea. I don't know what I ate today, not much of anything. What did I eat? I know I had some food. Not a lot. I have an avocado, I don't have any down there. That'd be good though. I do have avocados for uh, smoothies, I got them frozen. I'll probably go down there and make a smoothie in a little bit. That Vitamix, god damn, that's a great tool. That thing, until you use it, until you have one of those, you're not gonna understand. You'll think that it's just another blender. The Vitamix, turns solid materials into like just liquid. Like, you know how you, you make a smoothie in a blender and it stays thick and everything? Not with the Vitamix. I just, it's amazing. It just blends it all up into juice. I had no idea. I had no idea. That's why they're, you know, almost 500 bucks. To, you know, it's a fantastic tool. I mean, for making a smoothie, the Vitamix, there's no comparison. It has a 10 year guarantee on it. Do you know what I'm saying? Like you figure at least it's gonna go at least seven or eight years with a 10 year guarantee. Um, nice to see you too, James. How are you doing? I was talking about you the other day in the conservatory and how it went up for sale. Oh, thank you. I was uh, uh, 
talk, talking about how it went up for sale that one time. Yeah, she is, she is very attractive, and she, she's real cute. Very talented actress. Um, yeah, she's, she's very talented. She would have fit in at the National Shakespeare Conservatory. Yeah, a nice family owns that property now. What do you mean a nice family? Who's that? Someone you know? Did they rip the bungalows down? Friend of a friend, I see. Did, did they sort of keep it the same or? No, they probably knocked some of those down, right? I mean, why would you have those up? I wonder if Danny's house is still up. Not that that was any, you know, prize or anything, but yeah, it's still there. Danny's house is still there. Huh, I wonder about that old crappy swimming pool. That was pool studio gone. Oh, no shit. What about the pool? Is the, is the pool still there? Pool's still there, fuck. God, that pool was ancient. Fed by that spring, it was freezing. Dining hall gone, it's probably wise. Huh. That place was like on opening day, new building in its place. On opening day, it was like everybody showed up Instantly, there were, there were, you know, there was a bunch of actors taking off their clothes. There was, it was like Sodom, Sodom and Gomorrah at that place. Not me, I was an onlooker telling everybody to calm down. It was insane. There was nothing like getting a bunch of actors together. Most of them, I'm not gonna call them promiscuous, but there was a lot of stuff going on at that place. It was weird. It was weird, wild stuff. Not me. I was, I was innocent. It was back when I was innocent. And I wasn't an actor. 100 actors from all over the world, no rules. Pretty much, right? It was. It was filthy. No cell phones, that's right. Yeah, that, that place, that place was beautiful. I, I was talking about um, how, you know, that night where everybody would have to get up and sing. And I was, I had stage fright back then. I left. I pay phone. Yeah, that's right. I left. Every time that they, you know, they wanted people, everybody in the camp to sing. I was like, I can't do it. I had to leave. I went night fishing every time. Couldn't do it. Yeah, song fest. I couldn't do it, man. I was, I was terrified, James. It was weird. It was all the booze in me. You know, it was all that booze. It just fucked me up. And then, you know, a, maybe a little bit earlier than that, I probably did do some stand-up on stage, but I was hammered. That'd be wasted to do it. I did a little bit after that, too. And it was one, you know, had to be wasted to do it. Now I don't really give a shit, cause I'm sober, you know? But I was, I was a fucking wreck. I never get up there and sing. We're, I could have just gotten up there and sung Go Tell Aunt Grody. I did a bunch of coke up there one weekend, lost my mind, did you? You always seem pretty sane up there, uh, James. You always seemed like, uh, no, no, uh, leave, leave uh, Hillsby. Uh, that, that's, that's my friend from Krahonks and put him back. It's a, it's okay. He, he's talk, he's talking about a, um, he, he, he's, he's, he's talking about, uh, here, we'll, uh, we'll add James as a moderator. Um, you, you always seem like you had your shit together, James. You did. Uh, yeah, but this is, this guy's totally sober. This guy's talking about shit from the past. Um, you know, he's, I know him. He's, he's like, he's younger than me, but he's, you know, he's totally sober, dude. 
but James, you uh, you always seemed like you were, um, you, you and your brother had your shit together. Your brother being more straight-laced than you, I think. That's what I thought. Oh, and I remember how the, no, I won't talk about it, James. We'll start blushing. I won't, we were kind of masters. I won't, I won't talk about the other stuff, James. You know. Oh, there's James Wolf. Oh, he's a dreamboat. James. That wasn't me saying it. It was probably, you know, good times, though. It was good times. Da Danny. Danny was a fucking... God, he was a weird dude. I like Danny a lot. Um, Bob Gross. He just, I don't know. Never did anything for me. That's just me. Bob, running around naked, you know? Going up to the chow hall to eat, and there's Bob naked, you know? Gardening. It's like, whatever, you know, it's a human being. Got some, I have some stories, but I won't talk about it, because he's probably gone now. Uh, him and his van. That van. It's a rockin', don't come a knockin'. You know what I'm saying. Yeah, Bob, Bob Gross. Um, yeah, he is gone, I figured. He would have to be like 90 years old. He had a pacemaker back then, you know? He was, he was not young then. What's up, Troy? You know, he was, um, I ran, I ran into uh, Gary. I ran into Gary in Kansas City at the Grand Emporium once. I was hammered. I was wasted. Ran into Gary. I almost didn't, I was just like surprised me he was there. I didn't know what he was doing there. You know, Gary, um, Bob's friend. I don't know, he would come up with Bob. Yeah, um, I was just like, what, what are you doing here, dude? You know, like that. I, I don't, I still to this day, I don't know what he was doing at the Grand Emporium listening to that band. Uh, he was getting sober in Kansas City. Oh, is that right? No, well, he was at, you know what he could have been? He could have been in that movie, um, Article 99. He was an actor, right? He hit rock bottom. Oh, is that right? Well, that's good. You gotta hit rock bottom to quit. He might have been, Greg put him on a plane. Oh, is that right? Is, is, he, uh, is, is he sober to this day? I guess, because you said he hit rock bottom. That's great. That's great. What's he do? Does he act? He's like a good looking dude. You would think that he could have gotten acting gigs, right? Still lives in Greg's building. So he's in, he's in New York, is he, he's, he's acting? He acts. Lots of extra work, I could see that. Yeah. Huh. What, what about you and your brother? Do you, do you guys still put on uh, Moonwork Productions? Do you all still do that? You do, don't you? You do. No comment. No, you do not. Greg had a baby. Well, that'll put a damper on everything, won't it? Theater became too expensive, sure. Yeah, it's amazing, like any type of um, pursuit in art, how expensive it gets. Many of our friends moved on, yeah. You know, like Joe. Joe's still doing shit, you know? You see him on Facebook, he's still doing stuff. He might be in Cortland or something, but he's still like, he's still acting. Yep. He's still doing it, you know? Um, I just kind of suspected he would always sort of do it. Um, he's in Tennessee, is he really? No shit? I, th I thought he was, um, where is he, Nashville or something?
Yeah, still acting. I mean, I, I, didn't, I didn't know that. Um, outside of Nashville, yeah. Okay, that makes sense. You know, you know Steve, Stevie died. You know that, right? Stevie Lee Richardson? You know Stevie Lee? Yeah, that sucks, right? I didn't, I didn't know that Stevie was in the, uh, yeah, he was a good guy. I didn't know that he was in, um, yes, yeah, Stevie Lee. I, I didn't know that he was in the Jackass movies. I found that out after he died. So I never watched the Jackass movies, really. You know, I'd see bits and pieces. I never, never saw him in it. It was weird, right? What's up, Thomas? You know, Stevie, Stevie was, uh, Stevie was, I wrestled him once. He was an Illinois State wrestling champ, and hey, PL. And I wrestled him, and, well, I'm not going to say anything. He's gone. But I won. I won. But we were both the same weight class. But it was really sort of like, you know, he was so short. It's like he had, like, no leverage. I think that he probably psyched people out in high school. Like, oh, God, here comes the dwarf at me. Would have flipped me out. I really liked him. I drank a lot with him and, uh, and Joe. We'd, we'd go out drinking. I, I was talking about this the other day. I was telling Destiny, you know, one, one day we were at a, um, at a bar. We were, we were at a bar and some people came up, they were staring at him and then they came up and said something to him. And me and Joe wanted to beat the fuck out of this guy. And Steve said, nah, don't worry about it. It happens all the time. It's no big deal. Like this fucking asshole. You know, like that. Like, he was a good actor. I don't know why Dinklage made it so big and fucking Stevie. Well, Stevie did all right. I guess it's all, you know, Stevie did good. Dinklage lived down the street from me in Brooklyn. And uh, man, it was years, a few years later. He was just fucking, man, I remember seeing Dinklage in um, the Corner Bistro just hammered. Fucking, oh, did you do scenes with Tinklage? He was hammered, cro looking around for money. You know you know how the bar stools are here and the bars here? And then he, uh, mutual friends from Bennington College, no shit. So he was behind the, he was between the bar stools and the bar, like looking for money. I'm like, Peter, what are you doing? He goes, I'm looking for money. It's wasted. Then I don't see him for a couple years. He's a superstar. I think he was out working in LA or something. Now he's, Big time, man. Um, oh, you met Andy? Got focused, yeah, I guess. He was always focused, though, man. I would see the damn guy every day walking down Metropolitan Avenue. I'd say, you know, if, if I was on the street with the dogs, I'd say hello or whatever. I'd say, what are you doing? He goes, oh, I'm coming, you know, coming from a reading or something. He was... He went out every, every fucking thing his management sent him to, he was going to. That's how you got to do it. You can't be lazy. And Dinklage was not. You, I would see it. I'd always see him walking. He always had like this like leather biker bag, you know, like a, like a, every, every day, I swear to God, it was just like, where, where you been? And, oh, doing a reading for something. You know, he just, you know, that, that movie that he was in, The Train Conductor, you ever see that? It's really good. He 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 is a talented actor. It couldn't ha it couldn't happen to a nicer guy. Dinklage is a pretty nice guy. I'm, he seems like he, he probably would have kept his kept, he's probably kept his head and not, you know, he's a pretty level headed guy. It'd be hard to like the fame that he has now. My God, he's done everything. Um, that was his big break film, really. I believe it, because it was great. I mean, that was a great film. What's up, uh, one Sean Bond? Yeah, he was, uh, yeah, that, I, I believe that that was his bust out film. That makes sense. It was, it was, it was pretty good. Um, I think one of his greatest performances was as the giant in, um, God, what is that? When, when he makes Thor's new hammer? Whatever movie that was, I can't remember what which one that was, but man, that was a he was awesome in that as the giant. Yeah, let's make let's make Dinklage the giant. 
it will melt the um melt the metal create the axe my dog tonka's barking what a dick such a douche what a tool got a split i'll see you james nice seeing you tell your brother i said hello i'll see you later God, he's got a kid. He loves scotch. Your brother did love scotch. So did you, as I remember. No, your brother likes scotch. Man, that green tea is good. Where's Sean going? Hanging in hard times. Oh, uh, yeah, Sean. When's Sean Bond? You know, email me if you want to. Um, I hope everything's going well. I get what you're saying. Oh man, that's good. Yum, yum. Isn't that Tonka, what a tool. When I'm sad, I just talk to Rahel and Toxic. Yeah, they are good to talk to, aren't they? What, what's everybody else doing? Come on, Tonka, shut up. I don't wanna have to go down there and tell him to shut up. I see Toxic on TikTok. Hang on, Tonka! Tonka, no! What a dick. What's up, Ryle? When I'm sad, I stuff it all inside and get anxiety attack in a few days. Yeah, welcome to my world. Um, I'm gonna have to go down and fucking deal with that, man. I just wanna come up here and relax and have some tea. It sucks. He won't shut up. Doing a locating how. Should put a collar on him, but I didn't. I'll drink some more tea. I'm up here now. Oh, that's good. I'm an alien. Are you, Rahel? Is that true? Aren't we all? Who's a lizard person? Who is? She's a lizard person. Who, Rahel? People say to me, it must be nice to rescue pigeons, but I tell them they rescue me. I just had to let everyone know that you're an alien? Really, you're an alien? Thank you for telling me that. Licorice ice, licorice tea would be good. Hills B. Boy, that licorice ice cream was, is delicious. Um, that was a six buck from a planet 3.921. Um, I did make an, a licorice ice cream that's real good. Um, the tea ain't nothing like the licorice ice cream. The licorice ice cream's really tasty. Real good. Real, real good.
Ray, how's the sex bot, really? What's up on my mind? Nothing, really. I'm just drinking some tea up here. What's on your mind? Are you RHPL? RH? As a blood type? Going to work on some TikToks tomorrow. With my dogs, might do some about training with food. Yeah, I, I, I see you on TikTok. Toxic, you're cranking it out. You got two different TikToks, don't you? You have um, something about pumpkin and then you have another, another one, right? Is that correct? Two TikTok things. I tell I tell you something. Most of the shit on TikTok is garbage. It is. She's A B, and so that's my girl. Really? I'm O, o positive. I'm mutilated, mutilated to be. Yeah, most of it's just garbage, man. It'd be like some chick dancing. That isn't really good. I don't know what it is. It's just a lot of that, like stupid stuff. Um, I don't know. I check my TikTok. My my TikTok's doing good, but God damn it, Tonka! Can't I get some peas? I'm gonna have to go shut him up because he's in there making noise. It's probably bothering Destiny. She doesn't know how to shut him up. I should show her. My other account's gonna be an art and story account. What's, what's up, Pauline B? Um, huh. Ian, what? God, I, I, you know, I'm gonna have to go down there and tell him to shut up. I don't want to, I just wanna relax. I'm sure he's bothering Destiny. Uh, what, what's up, uh, Teresa Marie from California, IA? What's going on? But I tell you, that DEET is, uh, it's wonderful. You spray that DEET on and... Oh, thank you, Johnny O'Bubble. Really, you think? Thanks. Thanks, I guess. Could go quicker. Um... I put on an art one today that I know isn't going to get very many views, but I don't really care. It's an animated thing. I don't really give a shit. It doesn't really matter. I'm liking the tea. I don't know how much um, caffeine's in green tea, but it must have some. See you, Joseph. It's been interesting, really. These, uh, these glasses remind me of, like, Floyd's glasses from Mayberry Arm, RFD. Or was it Emmett? Emmett, the fix-it shop guy. Um... Yeah, it, do, it does, but you drink it weaker, so I don't know if it really counts. I read something like that, too. But we drink it weaker, so... Um, Hillsby. Boy, that ice cream maker is amazing. Hillsby, do you got do you got one of those ice cream makers? 
If you're drinking Turkish tea, it's super strong. Um, boy, that, that Cuisinite ice cream maker, that, that's an amazing tool. Hillsby, I would think that you would have one of those being a foodie. You should get one. Uh, nah, I make ice cream the old fashioned way. What, with a hand crank? Come on, man, that's bullshit. That's ridiculous, really? Espresso tea? How about uh, a bucket and, and the salt? It's fun, not really. If you say so. Ice and salt in a bowl and whisk in another bowl. Forget that. Bye, Rahel. See ya. That's just, come on, really? Try the Cuisinart. Throw it in there, turn it on. Come back, it's perfect. See you, Toxic. Bye, Lizard Queen. It's not about fastness. It's not about being fast, is it? I don't know. Good night, Toxic. Tub pumpkin, hello. Peggy. Ah, oh, that's good. The dog man was coming in here. Uh, it works so good. It does. It works really good. Fuck, I gotta go down there and deal with the dogs. I'm sure they're bothering Destiny. I'll finish this and go. Won't stop. We're a dick. Thank you. I liked it too. Well, you know, styling, styling's Destiny's thing. I can't tell her what to do, but there was talk of bones and hair. It looks like it's gonna rain again. We didn't have any bones, we wanted to get it shot. No, we were gonna use regular bones, but we didn't have any, couldn't find any. There's bones somewhere around here. Cow bones, chicken bones, there's stuff. We just couldn't find it. Chicken bones would have been great, but you gotta get them and then bleach them and just didn't have time to do it. Fucking Tonka, man, I just wanted to relax. Oh well, so much for that. And he's doing it right when it starts raining. You know. Ow! Fuck, now I gotta go back down the steps. It's not gonna be fun.
There you go. Yeah, it won't shut up. All right, I'm gonna go. I gotta go deal with Tomoko. I just wanted to uh, say hi, because, you know, there hasn't been a live stream lately, and, you know, I don't know. I missed you all. Um, that's all. That's it, just wanna say hi. I have a cold. Oh, shit. I'm sorry, PL. That sucks. That sucks, man. Write it out. Rest. You should sleep more. I, w I will do that, Hillsby. Cold suck, man. Uh, ter Teresa Marie. Th yeah, th thank you. I'll go, I'll go tell Tonka to shut up. I'll see you all. PL, sleep that thing off, man. Um, you know, I just do NyQuil. I don't know if they sell that in, in your country. Uh, I've slept a lot. That's key. All right, I'm going to go tell Tonka to shut up. I'll see you guys. Thanks again. I'll see you. Bye-bye. Oh, you have three babies to feed? You'll do it. Hang in there. Just get the babies fed. Fuck it. You'll live. I'll see you.